Salut, Pascal Moscato here. In this short video, we will see how to cast shadow. Uh, our scene sometimes looks flat. This is a quick way to pimp it up a little bit. So let's start. I have prepared a scene with two cubes, a floor, and two walls. From the asset browser, let's go in element and light, and let's add a light to our scene. I'll, I'll move that just a little bit like this. Now from shading element in the shader directory, we want to add a live shadow and I will simply drag and drop it on my floor. If you use replace all, you'll see the plane disappear and the shadow appears. Uh, so if you have textures, if you have shaders, it's going to be removed. Choosing Appen will simply put the shader at the bottom of the shaders list. So you'll keep your texture or anything else you have. So here you have it, uh, a simple shadow being cast on the ground. I will rename the shadow to uh, Planner Shadow. <clears throat> I would like also the wall to receive shadow. The shader we just created can be applied to many objects. You don't have to create a new one every time if the setup is similar. In this case, they are all planes. So simply drag and drop, use Appen again, like this. <clears throat> I would like now the cubes to receive shadow that they are casting, like here. I'm going to need a, a new live shadow shader for them. Uh, so I'll drag and drop a new one on the cubes and select Appen. If if I move the camera, you can notice here the shadow looks like a plane. <clears throat> it's because the shadow type is set to planner shadow. So let's change that to projective shadow. All right. <clears throat> and I'll assign that to my other cube. If I move this cube behind it, it receives shadow. <clears throat> and just to make things easier, I will rename that to projective shadow. And that's it. There you have it, shadows everywhere. Um, go ahead and create depth in your scene. Uh, I hope you've learned something. Please leave a thumbs up if the content is bringing you value. It helps me a lot. Consider sharing with a friend. And as always, I'll see you in the next one. À la prochaine!